Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. This is my philodendron birkin and today I decided to cut and propagate the whole plant. She has grown a lot and she is a little taller now and it's having difficulty in supporting the whole plant without the help of the support stick. And one more thing is that all the leaves are coming in one direction only. That is where the light is coming from. This is the part where she can receive most of the light. And in the back part of the plant which she cannot receive um, enough light, the leaves are not growing in that direction. So guys, let's start the propagation by cutting from the bottom part of the plant. And this is the bottom part which we will be keeping it into the same part and let's check after a few weeks if there will be new growth in it. And for the part which we have removed from the mother plant, we will cut this into three parts. This is the top cuttings with some aerial roots in it and then let's do another one for the remaining part of the plant. By the way guys, if you want to check the complete care for philodendron birkin, please do check the link from the description box below or you can also check from my playlist under philodendron. And then now we have three parts of the cuttings which we will be propagating in perlites and in water and the other one is in soil. And then after a few weeks we will be checking the progress of our propagation. So first let's propagate in a perlite medium. Make sure that the water is just enough for the perlites to become moist. And then just check it from time to time if there's still a little water at the bottom of your propagating vessel. And then for the water propagation, just put directly one of the cuttings inside the water. And make sure that all the nodes are properly submerged into the water. Thank you. 
and then we will also try to propagate the top part of the cuttings into the soil I am using a regular patting soil plus a lot of perlites because philodendrons needs a quick draining soil and then there you go our propagation is done don't forget to water the newly propagated plant in the soil so that's all for today guys and stay tuned for the update and if you still haven't subscribed please do click the subscribe button and the bell icon so you will be updated every time i'm having a new video thank you for watching guys and keep safe everyone i'll see you on the next one bye